uh, when we have our patient, we try and position them as we did in the upper and lower tension test. And we check if all the joints have the maximal range of motion needed for a structural test for, for an uplift neural tension test. We explain to patients what we mean when we ask them to slide the head away from us or towards us later on. Again, I take the patient's hand into a pistol grip with the thumb in abduction, asking the patient to tell me later on where patient where symptoms might be reproduced. The thumb and abduction and pistol grip, we slowly control elevation of a neutrally positioned shoulder blade and then we slowly move the upper arm towards abduction, horizontal extension, external rotation. We slowly extend the arm and dorsiflex the wrist and then the patient might tell us here that's where pain is and she explains to us the pain is in the upper arm it reproduces pain in the upper arm i turn the pain off the reproduction of pain off ask her to slide her head away from me and then pain is increasing for her again as she puts her head back pain is decreased i then dorsiflex the wrist more and again pain in the upper arm is reproduced and that is structural differentiation a positive sign for upper limb neural tension tests 